And we're going to be kicking off the uh, work week on a pretty familiar note that what we've seen these last couple of days, really the last week and a half or so, we've been just kind of hanging out in the upper 80s, near 90 degrees. We're going to do it for one more day as we get into this afternoon and then some big time changes headed our direction. You can thank this cold front that's going to be starting to approach, but it's also going to kind of kick up some of these winds as we get a southerly breeze that should help keep things stirred up right around 25 miles an hour. On the other side, though, of about 8 o'clock, that front's going to approach, and I think these storms going to be pretty tied to that. Not going to be seeing much activity out ahead of this system as we get into this evening. Here's feature track. We'll hang on to the winds tomorrow on the back side of this. Again, we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. We've got some storms in between us and our Tuesday. Here come those showers and thunderstorms really until about 8 and 9 o'clock. I think a lot of that going to be uh, holding off. It's going to be closer to about 10 and 11 o'clock on the latest run of future track here in Columbia and Jefferson City. And then it's just going to be more of that scattered activity as we get into the overnight hours. And again, really not expecting much of a severe threat. We might see it when these move on in, but there are some signs that again, we're pretty limited in that, but we'll have to watch out for maybe some gusty winds as we get into uh, this evening and into the early overnight hours. I think once we get on the other side of about midnight, we probably don't have enough to work with with some of these storms. But look at this as we get into the other side of this work week, really Tuesday afternoon on. So most of this work week for that matter, going to be uh, enjoying some weather finally across mid Missouri. First time we've been able to see that say that in about two weeks, it feels like back into the 70s for afternoon highs all the way through Thursday, maybe a touch warmer by Friday. 